groove. Everything is all right. Whoa, up on the roof. I'm happiest when I see how the work that I've created affects other people. That's everything. My name is Douglas Lyons. I am in Beautiful, the Carol King musical, and I have been performing professionally for nine years. I live in Astoria, home of the Queens. I love it, it's a getaway. I get away from the noise in the city, which is nice. There was always music in my life. My mother said I sang my first notes at two years old. I started singing in church when I was three years old, and music has always been a part of me. But the theater thing came a little bit later on. But when I was in high school, I remember seeing Rent, and looking at the stage, and for some reason, the lights and the costumes and the makeup, it just seemed like a world that I wanted to be a part of. It felt like a dream that I could attain. At 17, I enrolled as a BFA musical theater student. At 19 years old, I booked the uh, national tour of Rent. I first called my father who said, you must know you are going back to school. And I'm glad that I did. I covered six roles as a swing and learned so much about the stage, about the hustle, eight shows a week, about myself, about my sexuality. Coming out was like a three-step program. There's been, you know, the initial shock, and then there's been hope, and then there's been realism of this, this isn't gonna change, this is who I am. And then there's been acceptance, and underneath it all has been love. And so that's all that really matters, because everyone has opinions, but your parents you know, being there for you really, it really means a lot. My big break came in April of 2011 when they were looking for an additional swing to the original Broadway company of the Book of Mormon. And the final audition, it was between me and two other guys who combined had seven Broadway credits between the two of them and I had none, which was terrifying. And I just laid it all on the line and I sang from my heart. It was all I had and I booked it. I went and took pictures in front of the theater, I'm that guy, and um, updated my Facebook status to Broadway called. Us getting to Broadway is like a basketball player getting to the NBA. It's the top of the league. And yeah, and that the dream came true that day. Five, six. Yes, yes. There's one other thing too. Uh, you could write your story. Outside of eight shows a week, I write. I write music. In 2012, when I was doing the Book of Mormon First National Tour, I met this awesome guitarist by the name of Ethan Pakchar. And what started as some jam sessions in hotel rooms and rehearsal rooms became an album. And we started writing two musicals that we're working on. You get chills when you hear your song for the first time. You hope that it works, you hope that it moves and connects, and then you sort of let it go until it's in the hands of the singers. Yes, I'm yes. trying not to cry. <laughs> yes, yes. When I got the call for Beautiful, I knew nothing about the project. I went in on Tuesday and then got the call that Friday that I had booked it. It's rare that you come back to New York City and book a job in four days, which is, a blessing, it does not happen like that. The hardest part of eight shows a week is the repetition. Um, beautiful choreography on stage to the body does not always feel so beautiful. So for instance, in the locomotion, we do this one move with our shoulder, that's all on the right side. So my right shoulder and right Achilles have been overcompensated and it's not balancing on the left side. You are being showcased, but there is also a sacrifice to everything. At this point in the game, I just check to make sure my voice is all there, because the first note I sing um, is a song, there goes my baby, and it's like at the top of my range, so I have to just make sure it's there, because the last thing you want to do is get on stage and go for that note, and that note is not there. I love singing. I love the moment. I love engaging with the stage and engaging with the audience and just being open. It's my getaway from everyone. You know, I sort of leave the cast, close my eyes and sing.